Demi Lovato enters rehab after leaving hospital. After more than a week spent in the hospital following an apparent overdose, Demi Lovato is reportedly getting treatment at a rehabilitation facility, where she will remain for an extended period of time, TMZ reports. According to the news outlet, sources close to the singer say she was discharged from Cedars Sinai Medical Center in Los Angeles Saturday and took a private plane to the facility, which is not in California. While there is no set time frame, Lovato will reportedly remain at the treatment center for at least 30 days. I have always been transparent about my journey with addiction. What I've learned is that this illness is not something that disappears or fades with time. It is something I must continue to overcome and have not done yet, she started the letter to her fans. I want to thank God for keeping me alive and well. To my fans, I am forever grateful for all of your love and support throughout this past week and beyond. Your positive thoughts and prayers have helped me navigate through this difficult time. She thanked her family, team and the staff at Cedars Sinai who she said without she wouldn't be here writing this letter to all of you. I now need time to heal and focus on my sobriety and road to recovery, Lovato said. The love you have all shown me will never be forgotten and I look forward to the day where I can say I came out on the other side. Lovato signed the letter, I will keep fighting, heart emoji. The 25-year-old's team reportedly plans on removing the yes men and those who have negative influences on Lovato's life. Lovato was rushed to the hospital on Tuesday, July 24 after paramedics responded to an overdose 911 call. She was reportedly treated with Narcan, an emergency medication administered to reverse the effects of an opioid overdose. The overdose came after the skyscraper singer celebrated six years of sobriety in March. Three months later, she revealed in her new song Sober that she had relapsed.